Hello everyone, welcome back. So, as you can tell today, it's not an F3K at all. It's an Infinity F5J. So, uh, yeah, it's quite different than F3K, but anyway, so this is not mine. Uh, it's a friend who want I set it for him. I need to say I'm not the most experienced uh, to tune these things, but I'll try anyway. So uh, yes, uh, yesterday I I had some trouble with uh, <laughs> with the RSSI going really low, really quick. So right now I changed the receiver, I put some antenna tubes, and uh, yeah, we'll see what happened. So <laughs> I not I'm not used at all to fly a motorhead glider. So I don't like to launch it at all. Uh, it's not my thing. So let's do it anyway. Let's go. Okay. So uh, I'm should be all good right now. So this glider uh, is 3 meter on 50 centimeter wingspan, around 1.1 kilo, I think, one, maybe 1 1.2. Uh, and uh, I need to tune it for a friend. And uh, right now it looks quite good. Yes, it looks really good. So it's a basic tuning I did uh, because I found some tunes on the internet. Uh, sorry if my English is not that good. I'm not used to talk English any more uh, compared to before when I was doing two videos in English by week. <laughs> but I think it's quite interesting to see me uh, flying something else than F3K. Uh, actually, I might be. Uh, flying a 5J next year in 220, uh, 2020, sorry. So uh, I will check my air brakes. They look good. Whoa, little stall. And this glider stall so easy compared to F3K, even in turns. It's crazy. Uh, it's, the wingspan is so big. It's Really not what I'm used to. So I don't run any altimeter inside right now because I'm tuning it. So I want to be able to put the back the, the motor when I want to. So right now, uh, okay. So yeah, RSSI is critical really fast. <laughs> so I'm not really not used to it yet. Um, the controls are a bit weird and I'm at 50% of RSSI right here. So I'm really not far. I don't know what's happening. I think it's the radio going off. Uh, so maybe I should return the radio to make it check. But or maybe it's the receiver not powerful enough. I don't know. But the antennas are positioned quite good actually. So I don't know. Uh, yesterday I had a fail safe. I had to run really bad, really, really fast, and I got it back. So I'm quite, quite happy about that. Um, you see, low, low signal right here. So <laughs> I don't know if I turn the antenna, maybe. It's a bit better. But yes, uh, always it for me to fly a big thing like this. Maybe you're interested a bit in. Um, I, I don't like this size that much. It's a bit big for me. I can do it, but uh, to fly, it's, it's quite OK, actually. But the storage and all these things, it's so annoying. It's so annoying. It's it's big and 
I don't feel like it performs that much better than S3K. Uh, it it does for sure, but I feel like with a motorhead S3K correctly tuned, uh, it's not that far. But why 3.5 meter uh, perform only not by much better? It's it performs much better, but not that much. I was waiting for really more so maybe i would try to fly something like a three meter or maybe a bit smaller so i i will try to to get some f5 day around uh from friends uh to to be able to to do like f3k review i did before uh like an f5 day review but i i don't really want to buy gliders to do that uh, i will have one for myself for sure one or two uh, because I want to do competition uh, but uh, I don't want to to invest a ton of money because each glider will be twice or three times more expensive than an F3K so I don't want to spend that much of money into it so I will put again the engine and I will do just a quick pass at low throttle right around me. I think it's quite cool. And then... Yeehaw! So I climb like at 60 meters, something like this. Maybe a bit less. And it's not sinking that fast at all. Uh, it's it's th this is quite cool, but oh, I climbed in thermal mode. It's why it was not climbing that fast. But uh, yes, yeah, this glider perform actually pretty nice. I flew a four meter before a uh, Fortuna, and uh, I need to say I liked the Fortuna a bit better. Maybe because I don't know anything about F five J, but uh, the Fortuna was a bit. A bit better maybe it was better tuned too uh, because this one I need to say is not that good of a tune uh, but I played a bit already with the CG CG was way too much back uh, reward and uh, right now it's way better you see I can circle quite good with no any stall with no any waves So, our oh, co are coming, actually. <laughs> That's funny. I need to change of field while I'm flying. <laughs> okay. So, I think that will not be easy, but I need to jump over this wire without electrifying my balls. So yeah, I, I was wondering why there is no co in this field right now, but now I know because there was not there yet. So doesn't matter, I will continue to fly from here. I just need to don't land, need to catch it. And I don't like that because it's a big glider. Maybe I will go land in another field I, actually. Yeah, I will do that. <whistles> There's a dog. Hello. Bonjour, toi. So, I need to go a bit faster walking because I want to see it land and the fog is coming <laughs> yes I will land it in this softer field feel like it's better So, uh, I will run it, okay, it right now. 
and it's coming yeah perfect landing so that's it for this video i hope you liked it uh more flying really soon bye